writer Brandon Owen, and welcome to the Encore Minute. We are once again on location. This week we're at the Carroll Arts Center in Westminster, where we're at the 11th Annual Festival of Wreaths. And today I'm going to give you a tour of what you can see if you come down here to bid on all these wreaths. There's 225 of them. Uh, they go to the highest bidder here on Sunday. It's a fundraiser for the Carroll, Car Ca Carroll County Arts Council. And uh, we'll now take you on a tour to show you some of the wreaths that I've picked out that I really like. The wreath you're looking at now is called You Could Even Say It Glows. It was decorated by uh, Cindy May of Double Diamond Construction. And you're looking at seven CDs, which have been used as the head for the reindeer. And the lights uh, obviously provide the noses. And there's a wa homemade wire that you can plug it into. All right, this, is, this wreath is called Glorious Grinch. It's by <laughs> Corinne Zweiselsberger of Sykesville. And I actually talked to her about this wreath. Uh, she designed it with a Grinch theme, which is the first in the Art Center's uh, history. And the Grinch on the top is smiling. It's a happy Grinch. So even though it's a Grinch wreath, it's a happy one. All right, the wreath you're looking at uh, was designed by Papa Joe's Restaurant. And I've been told this is their first entry into the Festival of Wreaths. And uh, it's, it's already going for uh, $75 on the bed. So this one's going to be pretty expensive. And why, you ask? Well, there's five gift cards to Papa Joe's that are included with the wreath. All right, this wreath is called The Land of Oz. It's decorated by Cindy Engler of Westminster. Uh, she told me this was the first wreath that she by herself has put in, and it features a Wizard of Oz theme with everything you would find on the yellow brick road, including all your favorite characters. And now it's time for our Best Bets feature, which tells you about all the great events that are taking place in the region. Now, there's two we're highlighting this week. One is actually taking place in uh, this very gallery. They're going to have all the wreaths sold and, and taken out by Sunday. And next week, they're going to introduce the Small Wonders exhibit, which is going to feature all kinds of intricate artwork that is, of course, small. And there will be several local and regional artists included there. The reception is Thursday. And in, at the Lyric Opera House in Baltimore, uh, Vince Gill and Amy Grant are going to be in concert. Uh, the two of them obviously are married, and now they have both had uh, great success with holiday CDs uh, individually, but they have once again come together for a holiday tour. And of course you can read about that and all the other must-see events in Encore in Friday's edition of the Carroll County Times. That's all for this week for the Encore Minute. I'm Brandon Owen, and we look forward to seeing you once again next week.